Hi everyone, this is Intuitive Edge. Welcome once again to my channel. This is where we take an intuitive look at what's going on in our world. I'd like to take a look at what's going on with Steve Bannon. Now, he turned himself into the FBI as part of the January 6th commission. So let's take a look at what's going on with this and see what the cards have in store for him. Is he going to weather this storm or is he going to be caught up in this whole mess? What's going to be the outcome for him? I'm really curious. So I'm going to shuffle up the cards and we'll be right back and get started. Okay, I'm just going to talk through what I'm getting. Um, and hopefully at the end I will tie it all together with a nice pink bow. But I have to kind of talk this through because I'm getting messages coming in and I want to get out what I'm seeing. Okay, so the first card out is this Knight of Pentacles. Generally, this card means things kind of moving but very slowly. But I get just the imagery coming to me with the artwork. I just I get that he's sitting on something of value that they want from him. But it has to do with the mind. It has to do with his mind. I don't know if it's his what's in his head that they want from him. Um, but he I heard the word raw meat. I I. I I sense like sharks <laughs> in a frenzy wanting this guy, but it's, it's, they want something up here in his head. So maybe they're interrogating him. They want information from him, but they, they want something that he knows that they need to get. That's what I'm getting with that. Okay. Crossing it is the King of Cups. Seeing that King of Cups crossing it. Oh uh, yeah, they're making him an offer, but it's but it's also uh, it's interrogating, but also trying to make an offer or a deal or cut a deal to give up what they want. All right. Uh, third, wow, top card is the medicine wheel. Holy smokes. The Wheel of Fortune coming up top crowning this whole thing, meaning something has been put in place that is going to gain steam and gain momentum, and it's going to be difficult to stop it, okay? We have the Devil card coming up underneath, and that's what's led up to this. Yeah, there's something very sneaky and devious about, what, about this whole thing with him. Now he's got the King of Wands in the background, King of Taking Action, and the foreground coming up is the Hermit. <sighs> Sorry, Steve, but it looks like they're going to put you in solitary confinement. Um, that's what I get with that. Not a, not a fun place to go. Let's see. Um, all right, so the Eight of Pentacles coming up on him. He's, he. I still see that he's still sitting on something. He's still holding back. There's something that he has or knows that he's giving it like piecemeal. Like here's a, here's a little piece here. I'll throw you, I'll throw you a piece of raw meat. If you see me as raw meat, I'll throw you raw meat. <laughs> Here, have a piece. And so that's what I see with him. He's like he's like giving pieces here and there. Oh. Uh something about Yeah, this is the card. Ginger, I'm looking at ginger. Ginger is the herb associated with this card. It's it's got something it's laced with something. The the information he has it, or the stuff that he's giving out is laced. Maybe it's tainted. It's tainted somehow. What am I picking up on? Maybe I'll keep going and see if it clears up for me. I've got the ace on the environment. Still that whole idea of withholding information or I've got the goods. And I'm in I'm in control here. He I think Steve feels like he's in control, even by turning himself in or giving himself up. He still has the upper hand somehow. 
Okay, we have the Three of Wands also coming up here. This is a card of taking an opportunity or seeing an advantage from a, a better vantage point. And he, yeah. And, okay, all right. And the outcome, co outcome card is the Two of Cups, partnering, partnership. And the card underneath is the Nine of Pentacles. So there, there is some good coming of this somehow. Even though there's some, some chess moves going on with this. I feel like he's still holding back something that they want. But I, I'm just, that's just coming to me. He's giving them little pieces of what, and they think that they're getting something like really awesome. Um, no, I think they know that they know he's holding back. I think that's why they're going to, and I, this, this card of the hermit, you know, going within introspection, I just saw just the whole feeling of being in solitary confinement. I think that's coming for him, but let's see if I'm picking up on anything else here. I think he's that the truth is going to come to light along with this sense of Steve doling out this truth that's somehow mixed I don't know if it's mixed with untruths or just half truths but it's mixed and I sense that it's leading the investigators the FBI down this path but once they get to a certain point, it's like the point of no return and they, they're not gonna be able to walk back what they've done. Um, I don't, I don't wanna use the word, it's a, it's a trap. But I'm, you know, Steve's taking a big risk here. But there's something, there's something bigger at play that's playing out. We have the medicine wheel on that. The Wheel of Fortune. This is this is bigger than it looks, and it's playing out the way it needs to. And somehow it'll end up favorable with a partnership or something that comes of this. So I actually don't see this ending badly for Mr. Bannon. Um, maybe in the in the interim, while all of this is playing out, he's obviously going through a tough time. But uh, the, the cards actually look good on the future. I think distilling this down, I think the, the, that he is holding on to wisdom and knowledge. There's some funky shenanigans going on trying to extrapolate from him what they want, the FBI. Um, but there's, there's like a purpose behind this. And he's got... I pulled a couple more cards. He's got strength on him and justice underneath him and the Ace of Cups up top. So I I think he's in a good position even though he's going through what he's going through. So ultimately, this is going to work out. We'll have to see how it plays out. Again, I was getting the information being laced or tainted so I think that may be part of what's happening. Perhaps this witch hunt, I don't know what you want to call it, that the FBI is doing, uh, perhaps the information is going to uh, play out in such a way that maybe it just fizzles itself out, um, that they, don't, they ultimately don't get what they think they want or what they do get leads them on a path of no return that they can't come back from. So we'll have to see, but that's what I get for Mr. Bannon. So anyway, thank you for joining me. I hope you liked it. If you do, please leave a like and be sure to follow me on my other channels as well. I do post exclusive content over on Rumble at times. So you'll want to check me out there. And uh, also I am on Telegram. And if you want to support me, um, join me over on Patreon. We have a lot of fun there and I've got some good stuff over there. And so I'll see you around. Thanks everybody. Bye for now.